Hello, I'm Storm Tracker 18 Weather Chief Meteorologist Matt Schaefer. We are in a level four risk this evening for severe storms. Storm Prediction Center calls it a moderate risk, but what it means is widespread, long lived, and some particularly intense severe thunderstorms with all types of severe weather possible. Tornadoes are possible, along with widespread wind damage and hail. I think wind and hail are the primary threats but some of the wind gusts could be at tornado strength speeds. So regardless if there's some embedded tornadoes or if it's straight line wind damage, it all has the potential to do uh, the same thing in damage. Let's go to future cast early in the evening. There's just some showers in the area, but the storms will be popping up very quickly after that. Uh, really, once they pop, the entire line is going to gain strength and then move from north to south uh, around Eau Claire area on Highway 29. Fairly close to 10 o'clock is the latest update and then continuing south from there and out of the area shortly uh, after midnight and then continuing southward across the rest of the state. Clear skies and cooling a little, a little bit lower humidity too on Thursday. It's the transition day, but quiet weather is ahead after tonight's strong to severe thunderstorms and even after the storms uh, end, we will see uh, partial clearing uh, dew points still very humid throughout the night and into the day tomorrow 86 partly cloudy becoming sunny and dew points falling from about 70 to 60. So still a little humid at best, but getting out of the extreme humidity. And beyond that, we will not be too bad. Friday highs in the low 80s, a little bit more humid for Saturday. That's another cold front that's going to be moving through. Uh, that's also going to have a slight chance for showers and storms and mild weather is how we're going to enter the month of August. Highs around 80, perhaps even upper 70s Sunday, perhaps Monday too, with slow warming throughout the week and not much humidity, at least to start the week.